Hello loves and welcome into another video here at Comfy Chaos. I'm Bella and today we're going to be revisiting something that I've kind of made videos about before, crops, but in a very different way. We will be talking about carrots, canola, onions, and pumpkins and their respective biomes. So get ready, it's going to be a fun ride. Let's head to the meadow. Here in front of Goofy's stall, we're gonna see we have different vegetables to pick from. My advice, you unlock a biome, unlock the stall, fully upgrade it. That way you have access to everything that he has to offer. But here, we're gonna be talking about carrots. Why you ask? Well, for a starter crop, this is probably the best way and the fastest way to go ahead and get money. Let's say you want to go ahead and buy 100 carrot seeds. You're going to need a thousand coins to be able to do so. But once you go ahead and plant them, water them, and harvest them, let's, let's take a look at the math. You're ready to sell those 100 carrots. You're looking at getting 4,400 coins, profiting 3,400. And you can do this every 15 minutes because that's the harvest time for carrots. Honestly, that's the way I started making my money. And it was just a process of rinse, repeat, rinse, repeat. Now every 15 minutes could get a little bit uh, repetitive, but this is honestly, at least for me, the best way I've found to make the quickest amount of money as quickly as possible in order to progress to the next crop or crops, because we will be talking about two different ones in this next biome coming up. So carrot away in the beginning, it will be a huge help. Let's go on to the forest to talk about these next two crops that will be making a big difference. It's a very big change from carrots. Again, unlock the biome, unlock his stall, and fully upgrade Goofy's stall in order to get access to everything. Let's talk about canola and onions. These two are competitive. Let's talk about canola first. So you want to go ahead and buy 100 canola seeds, you're looking at a 2,500 coin cost. And that's just how much it's going to cost you. But doing the math on this, when you're ready to sell those 100 canola, you're going to be getting 10,900 coins back, which means a profit of 8,400. And that is going to be every 35 minutes because that is the canola harvest time. That's not bad, but it is a little bit different than the carrots. Now, let's go ahead and take a look at onions. Let's use the same formula. You wanna go ahead and buy 100 onion seeds. It will cost you 5,000 coins. With that said, let's do the math on this. Once you plant, water, harvest, you bring it to the stall to sell, you sell those 100 onions. You're looking at 17,000 coins. Coming out with a profit of 12,000 even. But, the harvesting time is a little longer. It's 75 minutes, which is not bad. It's just a little different. You will get a nice profit though. So this is something that'll be up to you. There's no right or wrong. It's just preference, but they're both amazing crops. Okay, now let's go ahead and head on over to Forgotten Lands for the last and final crop that we're gonna be talking about today. It's one that I've done a few videos of. <laughs> I'm sure you know exactly what I'm talking about. Pumpkins. There, That's pal. right. Pumpkins are a huge game changer in so many different ways. So let's say you want 100 pumpkin seeds. It will cost you 27,500 coins. Now let's go ahead and do the math on that so we can figure out exactly what the differences are. Once you sell those 100 pumpkins, you're looking at getting 66,400 coins profiting you 38,900. But then you have to think about harvesting time. It does take four hours to harvest pumpkins. So as you can see, every crop has very, very different timelines and very different profiting amounts. But there is no right, there is no wrong. It's up to you how you want to make your money, what crop you're the most comfortable with, Again, no right or wrong. This is your village after all. Hopefully you have the right information that you need to help you make maybe more of an informed decision. I hope that this video will help you in doing so. That said, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. 
I hope you guys have a great rest of your day slash night. Take care of yourselves, and we will see you on the next one. Bye! If you like what you saw, go ahead and click the like button, maybe comment, subscribe, and if you do subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know when the next video is coming. I think they want you to.